guys! So this is a very special video. I have my sister here with me. Her name is Holly. How old are you, Holly? Twelve. <laughs> like thirteen tomorrow, so big happy birthdays to Holly. So this is a video I've been wanting to do for a while. It's basically a trans sibling Q&A. Me being the trans guy, that one being the sibling. So let's do this. I got some questions from you guys and here we go. Did you know Alex was trans before he told you? No. No? Really? Well, like, I, I was a bit suspicious, like what's going on, but no. Oh, okay. Did you know what being trans was? Did you Have you ever heard of it before me? No. No? Okay. Mm. <laughs> there you go. Well, you are like 12, so. How did you find out about me being trans? By you telling me. Do you remember how I told you? Maybe I think you I just... did it really subtly, like. Yeah, I think I told you a down. few times. How hard was it to start using the right name and pronouns? It was like hard to start off with because, like, sort of a big thing in your life, you know what I mean? Then after a while, you sort of like get used to it. How did you feel when I first told you I was trans? I was okay with it. it didn't really like bother me, it was your decision, so... How does it make you feel when I talk about my transition to you? It doesn't make me feel any different <laughs> than a normal day, to be honest. Well, that's a good thing. At least it doesn't make you feel weird. Well, unless it was like someone's bully, I'd be like, right, that's it. <laughs> Go up to the house, beat them up. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Break Don't it. mess with me, you got this one to deal with. So, I actually remember something specific to me was recently when I started talking to you about, you know, when I get top surgery and when I'm going to be like shirtless around the house and stuff and you were like, eh, doesn't really bother me. <laughs> It'd be weird, but it doesn't really bother me. So this person actually says they are trans yeah. and how should they go about getting their siblings to use the right name and pronouns? How should they make them understand what it means to be trans? Well, like, sit them down. Don't be like, Oh yeah, deal with it. Every time they use the wrong name, just remind them that that's not... So like, ease um, them into it? Is yeah. that what you're saying? Right. Like, gently... Not just a big, like, hello, I'm a man. Yeah. I'm a man now, I'm gonna get my moobs chopped <laughs> off, I'm gonna get injections in my butt to make me <laughs> have a deeper voice. So not like that, just be like, listen, I'm feeling some things. Well, if they're, if they're like, nine then don't tell them all that stuff but if they're like my age then maybe you should like prompt them a bit but yeah, not tell them a little bit yeah like each month maybe yeah like gradually that sounds build good. it up that sounds good okay this is a good question how do you feel about me putting my transition out there onto youtube i feel like it's fine but then like one side of me is a bit worried mm -hmm. why are you worried because say if someone just randomly came to our house and slapped you around the face so you're scared about people like finding yeah. me and not liking what I do yeah. and hurting me. Like I don't care if they came around your house and was like, oh my god! Well this is a really interesting question. Someone said to Holly, did you question your gender after Alex came out because my mum doesn't want me to come out because she's afraid I will confuse my younger brothers. Not really. I was sort of just like... <laughs> it's my thing, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I, I want to stay as me, and you can stay as you. Yep, <laughs> there we go. Holly Bay, 2015 everyone. <laughs> <laughs> if you have any advice to parents of a trans person, what would it be? Don't shout at them just because they want to be different. Just take a chill pill, <laughs> think about it. <laughs> <laughs> and, and maybe respect their decision? Yes. Kind of support them in any way they can? And don't abandon them. That's the end of the questions from you guys. I have some questions for you. Testing your knowledge of trans terms. Alright? Yep. Yeah. Look at you, you're so done. You're like, yes, hit me. <laughs> I'm ready. Do you know what dysphoria means? No. Dysphoria. Okay, so dysphoria is basically when I feel uncomfortable about my body. If you were to look at yourself and be like, oh, my thighs are too big. <laughs> like, that's the feeling I have about my whole body, pretty much. It's about my chest about my other stuff, about how skinny my arms are, about anything that is basically not what I want to be. Get it? Yep. Yeah. What about your ears? Are they okay? I mean, Jake bullies me with my ears, but other than that, I think they're fine. Do you know what top surgery is? Isn't it where, like, your chesty bit gets, like, removed? They're, like, yeah, inside? Pretty much. Yeah. Yeah. Or, like, the tissue inside gets taken out. Okay, do you know what bottom surgery is. It's where, isn't it where like, 
if you were a girl then that bit would have got chopped off and then if you were a boy, I don't know. I'm kind of getting there, yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Where if you have a female body, it would be turned into male mm. parts and then the other way around. Yeah. You get what I mean? Yeah. Cool. So for all of you asking how to talk to your younger sibling about this kind of stuff, you do it in vague terms. And you, there's a lot of like, do you understand what I'm saying? I'll just record a video and put it on YouTube. Do you know what binding means? Binding? Where people bind? I don't know. I have a binder. You know what my binder does, right? Oh, oh, it pushes the things back. Yeah, <laughs> I love the way you're not using the actual words. Good job, <laughs> I like that. Do you know what packing is? They pack to go on holiday? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, <laughs> okay, so packing is where you put something down your pants yep. to make it seem like you have a bulge. Yep. Like a winky. Yep. <laughs> yep. Okay, here's an interesting question. If you could name me any name other than Alex, what would it have been? Stitch. Yeah! <laughs> I went through a lot of emotions then. At first, I was like, what? Mm. Mm. Yeah! <laughs> That'd be such a quirky name. <laughs> if I could name you any name, it would be... Tamira. <laughs> I don't know. Do you have any questions for me? Why did you choose to change besides you didn't like your appearance? Basically, I could choose to not physically transition and change my body, but being trans for me just isn't a choice like the way I feel in my head I can't change that like I can't just sit there and go hmm yeah I could be a lady like it just no you know it just doesn't work for me it's like you I couldn't tell you to just be a boy you know what I mean yeah just the same way as I can't just be a girl because it's not who I am it's not me Okay guys, so that was our video, that was our sibling Q&A. By all means, if you have any more questions for Holly about me being trans, comment down below and maybe we'll do a part two. Would you be up for a part two? Would you be up for a part two? Hi bye. Oh. <laughs> Take two. <laughs> you! That was so good! So good! How? <laughs>